हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू द वर्चुअल क्लास ऑफ स्टैंडर्ड कॉस्टिंग इन प्रीवियस सेशंस आई हैव डिस्कस्ड सेल्स वेरायसिस एंड इन लास्ट सेशन आई हैव डिस्कस्ड बेसिक्स ऑफ सेल्स वेरायसिस बेस्ड ऑन मार्जिन और यू कैन से प्रॉफिट वेरायसिस today i would like to discuss a practical question with some changes in the variety of question let us refer the question first on your screen information related to budgeted data for product a b and c and actual data for product a b and c is given in this information we have units of sales sell price per unit and cost per unit for budgeted data and actual data we need to calculate sales margin variance sales margin price variance sales margin volume variance sales margin mix variance sales margin quantity or sub volume variance in a previous session i have discussed in detail so let me explain you this particular concept in detail again for the purpose of your reference here we need to calculate all five variances based on sales margin sales margin is referred to as profit it means we need to calculate all five variances based on the figure of profit here we have information of sell price and cost price for budgeted data and actual data so let us calculate amount of profit first as we all know that profit equals to sell price minus cost price the examiner has given information of sell price for product a b and c as well as for actual data it is also given for product a b and c so let us calculate profit figure for budgeted data sell price for product a rupees 24 per unit cost price rupees 20 per unit so profit per unit for product a is rupees 4 per unit for product b 22 per unit 16 per unit 22 minus 16 is equal to 6 per unit and for product c sell price rupees 20 per unit minus cost price rupees 12 given in the question so amount of profit per unit is rupees 8 same way on your screen information of actual data is available sell price for product a is rupees 25 minus the cost price per unit is rupees 20 so amount of actual profit for product a is rupees 5 per unit for product b cost price is 17.5 while sell price is rupees 23 23 minus 17.5 equals to 5.5 and for product c sell price is rupees 21 and cost price is rupees 14 so profit per unit in case of product c is rupees 7 per unit now using the figure of profit available to us for budgeted data rupees 4 rupees 6 and rupees 8 and in case of actual data rupees 5 rupees 5.5 and rupees 7 per unit we need to prepare our table so let us prepare the table product abc quantity 50000 30000 and 20000 as given in the question 
बजेटेड प्रॉफिट एज पर अवर कैलक्युलेशन फोर सिक्स एंड एट सो बजेटेड अमाउंट ऑफ प्रॉफिट इज फिफ्टी थाउजेंड मल्टीप्लाइड बाई फोर टू लैक्स थर्टी थाउजेंड मल्टीप्लाइड बाई सिक्स वन लैख एटी थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड मल्टीप्लाइड बाई एट वन लैख सिक्सटी थाउजेंड सेम वे इंफॉर्मेशन रिलेटेड टू एक्चुअल क्वांटिटी सिक्सटी थाउजेंड फॉर प्रोडक्ट ए फोर्टी थाउजेंड फॉर प्रोडक्ट बी एंड एटीन थाउजेंड फॉर प्रोडक्ट सी This information is given to us in the question, and we have completed calculation of budgeted profit, actual profit for product A, rupees of five, product B, rupees of five point five, and product C, rupees seven. Using information of quantity and profit, we can easily calculate actual profit with the help of multiplication. So sixty thousand. Multiplied by five equals to three lakhs. Forty thousand multiplied by five point five equals to two lakhs twenty thousand. And eighteen thousand multiplied by seven is equal to one lakh twenty six thousand. So total actual profit is rupees six lakhs forty six thousand. For the purpose of calculation of revised budgeted quantity. we are in a need of total budgeted quantity that is a tbq and total actual quantity that is taq with this our database is complete now using this database we need to apply all variances one by one and calculation of variance is a very simple it is a simple let us calculate first variance the first variance is sales margin value variance formula for the same budgeted profit minus actual profit if we would like to expand the formula then budgeted quantity multiplied by budgeted profit minus actual quantity multiplied by actual profit in abbreviation bq into bp minus aq into ap now you can check the question that we have completed over here and with the help of this we have already prepared our statement so from this statement we can easily judge that we can apply all the values in the formula 2 lakhs budgeted profit actual profit 3 lakhs so the result is 1 lakh favorable for product b budgeted profit 1 lakh 80000 against to which the company has earned an actual profit of rupees 2 lakhs 20000 so the result is 40000 favorable product c 1 lakh 60000 minus 1 lakh 26000 so it's a 34000 adverse and a total sales margin variance margin value variance become rupees 1 lakh 6000 favorable let us move to second variance sales margin price variance actual quantity into bracket budgeted profit minus actual profit now use the same mechanism for the calculation product a actual quantity is 60000 units budgeted profit rupees 4 per unit minus actual profit rupees 5 per unit so here actual profit is increased by rupee 1 so the difference is 60000 favorable for product b 40000 units budgeted profit is 6 and actual profit is a decreased by 0.5 because actual profit is rupees 5.5 so the net difference is rupees 20000 adverse for product c 18000 units referred to as actual quantity budgeted profit is 8 rupees while actual profit is rupees 7 so the difference is 18000 adverse using 
the difference of a b and c we can easily calculate total sales margin price variance it is rupees 22000 favorable let us move to third variance it is sales margin volume variance because of the change in sales quantity we are facing the problem of the differences formula budgeted profit into bracket budgeted quantity minus actual quantity so in abbreviation you can write bp bq minus aq for product a budgeted profit is 4 rupees 50000 budgeted quantity against to which actual quantity is 60000 so here quantity is increased by 10000 units multiplied by rupees 4 so the difference is referred to as 40000 favorable in case of product a if you follow same mechanism for the calculation of product b you can find difference of rupees 60000 which is referred to as favorable and for product c it is adverse because as compared to budgeted quantity actual quantity is less so total sales margin volume variance is rupees 84000 favorable let us move to fourth variance it is sales margin mix variance so formula budgeted profit into bracket revised budgeted quantity minus actual quantity we have information of budgeted profit and actual quantity in a ready made form but as you all know that before calculation of mix variance we need to calculate revised budgeted quantity and formula for revised budgeted quantity is total actual quantity divided by total budgeted quantity multiplied by budgeted quantity of concerned product as a calculate for product a 1 lakh 18000 total actual quantity divided by total budgeted quantity 1 lakh multiplied by budgeted quantity of product a 50000 units so 59000 units same way you can calculate for product b it is 35400 units and for product c it is 23600 units once you are clear for the concept and if you remember all the formula you can score full marks in this chapter so nothing is new simply we need to calculate as and when it is required and simply insert the values in the formula let us calculate for product a budgeted price rupees 4 but sorry budgeted profit rupees 4 revised budgeted quantity as per our calculation 59000 and actual quantity is 60000 given by the examiner so as compared to rbq our aq is greater so the difference is 4000 favorable same way in case of product b as compared to revised budgeted quantity our actual quantity is higher so difference of rupees 27600 is referred to as favorable but in case of product c our revised budgeted quantity is 23600 units while our actual quantity is 18000 units only so in case of product c actual quantity is a less than that of rbq so it is a negative sign for the business and that is why the difference of rupees of 44800 is referred to as adverse variance total sales margin mix variance rupees 13200 adverse after calculation of sales margin mix variance let us move to last variance it is sales margin quantity or sub volume variance 
formula for the calculation of sub volume budgeted profit into bracket revised budgeted quantity minus budgeted quantity you can say it is a comparison of rbq and bq here it is a very simple to interpret the variance if rbq is a greater then difference is referred to as favorable and if bq is higher than that of rbq difference is referred to as negative or adverse formula as you all know budgeted profit bp into bracket rbq minus bq you can change the variables in the formula your final answer remain same product a budgeted profit as per our calculation rupees 4 revised budgeted quantity as per our calculation just made before a few moments 59000 minus budgeted quantity given by the examiner in a ready made form 50000 units here as compared to budgeted quantity rbq is higher so when rbq is higher it is so the result is 36000 for product b same situation our budgeted quantity is 30000 units while revised budgeted quantity is 35400 units here revised budgeted quantity is higher so difference of rupees 32400 referred to as favorable same in case of product c it is 28800 favorable so total sales margin quantity variance resulting into 97200 favorable as per our tradition at the end of the calculation of all five variances we used to verify with all variances one by one sales margin value variance 16000 favorable 16000 favorable is due to sales margin price and sales margin volume that you can check on your screen 22000 favorable 84000 favorable resulting into 16000 favorable sales margin volume is because of sales margin mix and sales margin quantity you can check on your screen sales margin mix variance is rupees 13200 adverse while quantity variance is rupees 97200 favorable so 97200 favorable 13200 adverse resulting into 84000 favorable so you can check from bottom to top sales margin mix 13200 adverse sales margin quantity 97200 favorable result of this two is sales margin volume variance rupees 84000 favorable sales margin price variance rupees 22000 favorable sales margin price 22 favorable and sales margin volume 84000 favorable ultimately resulting into sales margin value variance so if your answer is perfect by all means in calculation you can settle down all five variances one by one in this way i hope everybody is clear with the calculation see you in next virtual class thank you god bless you keep learning keep growing